morning. Thanks for joining us for Local 3 News. I'm Brianna McLean. And joining me this morning via video chat is Caitlin Norlin, a fitness coordinator at Aspire's Keweenaw. Today we are talking about making healthy fitness goals for 2022. Caitlin, what are some realistic goals when it comes to New Year's resolutions and exercise? So a realistic goal would be losing 10 pounds in eight weeks. Um, a lot of times for New Year's resolutions, weight loss is a big thing. And someone might what someone might say losing 100 pounds in a short period of time, which is just not realistic. Um, losing that 10 to 10 pounds in about eight weeks is more specific and achievable because it's a healthy weight loss. Um, it's recommended a weight loss of one to two pounds a week. So um, another one would be, well, I'll go with a more unrealistic would be someone wanting a gym membership, buying a gym membership and saying, I'm going to use the gym every day. And this could be someone that didn't even work out before this. More realistic would be using the gym two to three days per week um, for X amount of time, say 45 minutes. So being having a plan and being more specific will likely get you to follow through more. What are some ways to keep yourself accountable with your goals and keep with them for the rest of the year? Joining a fitness challenge, um, following a specific workout program, hiring a personal trainer, um, join group fitness classes. You could post on social media to help yourself stay accountable. Um, having that family or friend support or even having an exercise or gym buddy. Thank you, Caitlin, for joining me this morning. Now for a check on your forecast with meteorologist Tom Kippen. Thanks a lot, Bree. A lot of people getting going back to work and back to school today for the new year. And if you're on the go, download our free WJMN Local 3 app, also online at upmatters.com. That's where we do have an interactive radar at the bottom of the weather page. Track any precipitation, including snow there. Also, it will have the latest forecast update for today and also for this week. If social media is your thing, we're there as well at WJMN TV and our 906 Weather Watchers page.